Golf Cart Garage gets a ton of calls and emails just like this one. I need to know whether I should leave my golf cart plugged in all the time or just charge it as needed. And how much should I charge it? So it's time to ask Dave right now on GCG TV. Hi everyone, welcome and thank you for joining us at GolfCartGarage.com. Today on GCG TV, we're covering the basics of automatic golf cart charging. There's lots of companies that make chargers and they don't all have smart charging or storage charging. Contacting the manufacturer of your charger or searching for its specifications online can help you know how capable it may be or how often you should use it. Deep cycle batteries that power golf carts are best maintained when they're kept fully charged during downtime. This doesn't mean that they should always be actively charging, it simply means that once they're used for a while, they should be charged up to full and that charge should be maintained at regular intervals to make sure that they don't go dead, as this can cause damage. That said, if you owned a Summit 2 charger from Golf Cart Garage, you'd already be done thinking about this one. Automatic storage charging and automatic smart charging are just two of its long list of great features. It gives your cart the best, fastest smart charge ever and then automatically enters a storage mode to regularly check and maintain your batteries. We want to help you with your concerns about charging or anything else you may need. So come ask Dave in person next time. Stop by GolfCartGarage.com or give us a call 1-800-401-2934. Or if you send an email to askdave at GolfCartGarage.com, the next question we answer might be yours. Remember to subscribe to our channel for more episodes. Thanks for watching GCG TV.